Hey, Brian Beckham at VB Attorneys. Uh, you know, I've been following the news like a lot of you guys. I'm in my home office right now. I have been for weeks and weeks, uh, self-isolating because of the coronavirus. But I've been asked about this Liberty University thing and Jerry Falwell Jr. And whether uh, Liberty University or Mr. Falwell could get sued for their conduct as it relates to the coronavirus. And I think the answer to that question is absolutely yes. Um, as many of you remember, uh, Mr. Falwell Jr., after we all knew how contagious the coronavirus was and potentially deadly, was out there uh, publicly encouraging his students to come back to school against every single bit of scientific and medical advice that was out there that had any credibility whatsoever. And so, you know, I, Basically, in a negligence case, you have to prove three things. You have to prove duty, you have to prove that there was a breach of the duty, and you have to prove damages. So let's talk about that real quick. Did Liberty University or Mr. Falwell Jr. have a duty to his students? I think the answer to that is absolutely yes. Uh, of course he does. Of course the university has a duty to its students. Number two, did they breach that duty? Well, I think that is absolutely clear as well. Every single medical and scientific doctor out there that knew what they were talking about was saying this was a terrible idea and Falwell Jr. was encouraging his students to come back despite that. He was encouraging students to come back during the middle of a viral pneumonia pandemic that the president has declared a national emergency. He was doing that after it was declared a national emergency. So uh, yes, I think there clearly was a breach. Uh, and then if somebody gets coronavirus, then clearly there are damages there. So. Liberty University may have some trouble. I've, I've seen on the news re recently where Mr. Falwell Jr. is now <laughs> issuing subpoenas to reporters because he doesn't want people to know the truth about what happened. That's what it looks like to me. He's just trying to intimidate him uh, for his idiotic decisions. But Liberty University has, uh, in my opinion, legal exposure uh, for these decisions that were made long after we knew uh, that it was unsafe to have people in large gatherings like this. Uh, if you have any questions at all uh, about any legal issues related to uh, the coronavirus or anything like that, we're still open. We're working remotely. We haven't shut down one day. Our phone number is 713-224-7800, and our website is vbattorneys.com. That's V as in Victor, B as in Brian, attorneys.com. Stay safe.